beautiful piece. So this is one where you hear Vince's or you see his hand on it. Uh, in 1983, the great composer Chico Buarque and the great composer Edu Lobo paired up together to write a large piece for the stage that would incorporate theater, dance, music, of course, and even circus arts. It was called O Grande Circo Místico, uh, the great mystical circle or mystic circus. And in it, the story is of an aristocrat, well, the center of the story, an aristocrat who falls in love with the actress, the, the beautiful dancer and acrobat. Her name was Agnes. Well, Chico Buarque, the poet, looked at that and said, I can't write for Agnes. <laughs> I am not inspired by this name. This calls for nothing. Who's Agnes? And he was quite frustrated. So he went looking for inspiration and remembered that there was Beatriz or Beatrice from Dante's, uh, from the Divine Comedy and from Inferno. And then Beatrice is the one who guides Virgil from hell back into heaven. So he wrote thinking of Beatrice. And Edu Lobo wrote the music in a sort of a, a constant ascension and these really wide leaps in the melody, just really beautiful as if the acrobat is dancing. Uh, and, and showing us her abilities. And Chico Buarque writes the poem as a series of questions. Is she young? Is her face made of porcelain? Is she made of ether? Does she cry alone in her hotel room? And when she dances um, above the skyscrapers, will she fall? Will anybody catch her? This is Beatriz.
Será que é divina a vida da atriz? Se ela um dia despencar do céu E se os pagantes exigirem E se o um arcanjo passar o chapéu E se eu pudesse entrar na sua vida